Good afternoon, guys. Sports Mania card here. This is episode 8 of my Jeff Bagwell PC. All the cards in this video will be from 1999. This are, these are mainly um, inserts, parallels. Um, there's a few nicer base cards, um, but all my base cards are in a binder. I'll do those at a separate time. So we start out here with this beautiful die cut from 1999 Pacific. We got Wonder Years from Upper Deck. Die Cut Power Brokers from Tops. Non Refractor. <clears throat> Picture Perfect from Tops. Early Road to the Hall. Tops Chrome. This is from uh, Pacific Crown Royale, Pillars of the Game. Got a nice gold medallion from Fleur Ultra. Fleur Showcase Power. This is a uh, row three, seat seven, Showtime. So there's different parallels of this card. Got the Forte Blue from Upper Deck. I love these. These are real nice. I'm trying to work on this rainbow. Got a couple of the blue Fortes. These also come in a die cut version. It's another beauty here from Prism. This is a gigantic rainbow, but I can't remember. There's like a silver and a pebble dot and a prism and a gold pink. There's so many of them. I'm not even trying to work on that rainbow. If I get, if I pick them up cheap, good. But I'm not going to stress over putting together the rainbow with this, even though it is it is beautiful. Uh, it says launchers from uh, holographics a predict choice preview again these are all from 1999 this is the preview of a predict choice rbi kings from fleur ultra view to a thrill from upper deck the base card of Fleer Brilliance. Another nice Pacific die cut. I'm pretty sure there's just a base card from Pacific. Crown Royale. And a textbook excellence from Upper Deck. This is an Encore... Um, Driving Forces, some Upper Deck brand. It's got a lot, of, a lot of nice rainbow effect in it. This one is from Fleer Tradition, but this is the uh, Millennium Edition parallel. You can see down here, the stamp down here. Um, these were issued only on the Shop at Home TV network. Uh, 5,000 factory, factory sets were printed and, and sold. So it's a, it's a parallel. It doesn't go for too expensive, but uh, it's, it's always fun to have those oddball type things that you couldn't get out of packs. Again, this was a shop at home network. I don't I, only exclusive. It's a nice tops gold label. Class two. Fleer Headliners from Sports Illustrated brand. It's a nice one here. This is from uh, Metal Fusion. This is Supernatural Fusion. As a, kind of like a dot matrix back here. It is, it is see-through. I don't know if you can tell, but... This printout of Bagwell here is like a dot matrix. It's 
holes see through. So it's pretty neat. From Fleur Ultra, the book on Spring Fling out of Skybox Premium. Soul of the Game out of Skybox Premium. Planet Metal from Metal Universe. Nice die cut card here. This is from uh, Pacific Revolution. I believe this is just a base card, but it's a beautiful base card. Not a lot of nice shine on it. And we got um, Diamond Glory from Pacific Prism. We got another Topps Gold label here. Uh, this is Class 1. We got Class, class 2 and Class 1. Beautiful cards. So I need to pick up a Class 3. It's another early road to the hall. I showed one earlier. I have two of them. This is from Top Stars. This is the one star. And then here's the two star. There's also a three star. And there's also serial numbered of each one of these. Like a foil parallel. <clears throat> we all love Lords of the Diamond from Tops. Nice die cut card. Got two of those. And then also have the refractor from Topps Chrome. That's beautiful. Topps Tech. Hi, uh, yeah, Topps Tech. There's so many of these. This is another set that I'm not going to stress over picking up all these patterns. There's so many. If I see them cheap, I'll grab them, but I'm not going to kill myself keeping track of that parallel set from tops all mystery all tops mystery finest bowman early risers there's a little um rainbow i have going so you got the uh, 99 bowman you got the 99 bowman international 99 bowman chrome 99 Bowman Chrome Refractor. I have two of those. And then the uh, 99 Bowman Chrome International. So I need the International Refractor. I need the Bowman Gold. Bowman International Refractor Gold. So a fun set to work on. From Stars and Steels. Just a base card, but nice heavy duty base card. There's a gold and a holographic gold in this. Top's finest leading indicators. If you put um, take the card out of here, you can touch this and it turns colors. From Top's finest, Pill and Reveal. Then we got the Pill and Reveal Sparkle on the right. There's also a Hyper Plaid or something like that. It's just a base card of victory, a little rainbow I'm working on. So you got victory, you got ultimate victory, and then you've got this baby here, ultimate victory, ultimate, zero numbered out of 100. This is one of my all-time favorite cards that I have a bag for right now. That's why it's in a, a mini snap, a, a snap top, a magnetic, whatever, you know what I'm talking about. So yeah, zero number to 100. Uh, from Ultimate Victory, Bleacher Reachers. Holographics, base card. Base card, look at all that going on. Disco time. And then the gold one. From Upper Deck, this is the um, Power Deck. Auxiliary power. This is also from Upper Deck here. It's the actual little deck, the disc that you stick in a computer. 
And um, I guess it kind of talks about Bagwell's career up to the point. This is one of my favorites. These are the Cybers out of Ionix. These are 1 in 53, so pretty tough pull. Ended up with two of them. Another one from Ionix, Techno. There's a small rainbow I'm working on. This is from Upper Deck Choice Star Quest. You've got the blue, you've got the green, you've got the red. These aren't very tough. I think the red is the hardest at like 1 in 23. But then there's also a gold number to like 100. That's very, very tough. So chances are I will probably never own one of those. They usually go for $100 if not more. But I'm, I'm happy with these. These are real pretty. Blue, green, red. Here's the Forte I was talking about again. This is the uh, green double. It's uh, die cut. Serial number to 2000 down here. Beautiful card. From Upper Deck, this is Statitude. Upper Deck Encore, Pure Excitement. Upper Deck Encore Homer. SP Authentic. I uh, forget what this one is called. I'm not real sure. <clears throat> SP Authentic Epic Figures. These cards have a nice shine on them. I predict Barrage. A couple more here. We got a Black Diamond. Um, Diamond Might. And lastly, this is from, you got these from subscribing to the Houston Astros Buddy Clubs. I'm pretty sure this is a 99 version because it says career stats through the 98 season. So these were either produced late 98 or early 99, but um, could only get these by joining the Buddies Club. No, I didn't join the Buddies Club in 99. I would have been 26, but I saw these on eBay a while back, a whole set of five. Um, I can't remember. I think it was Bagwell, BGO, Jose Cruz, a picture of the Astrodome, uh, one other. I'm not sure who it was, but anyway, I enjoy that card. So anyway, if you just saw this video, um, I would appreciate it if you check out the video before this. I was in the hospital for five days. Um, I had a mini heart attack. I'm okay. Um, I wasn't, I don't think it was as serious as it sounds. Anytime you say heart attack, you think it's pretty bad, but, um, I think everything's cool. I'm on medication, seeing doctors. Thank you everybody for your out, your outpour of prayers and thoughts. Um, shout out to my buddies, Jake, Jake1725 on Twitter. Jake's just always there for me morally and spiritually. And then my buddy, Aaron Kaiser. Um, he's on Twitter as well, A Kaiser Seven. Um, he's a great friend of mine. He's always there for me as well, spiritually. Um, always, he's always looking out for cards for me. So yeah, um, hope you enjoyed this video, and I will hopefully be posting more often now that I'm out of the hospital. Get back into my routine. Hopefully, have a great day. Later.